I'm sitting in the car and I have the AC running. Now, well, it won't be running in a few days. No. Not when it's in the 20s outside. I have my don't be a degenerate shirt on. Yeah, you don't want to be a degenerate. No. Mm -mm. What's that? It's having lost the physical, mental, and moral qualities considered normal and desirable, showing evidence of decline. Lacking some property or the distinctness of structure, previously but usually present, immoral or corrupt. That's what it means. You don't want to do that. You don't want to be there. It's not good, no. At least not right now. Unless they change the definition of good, like they change the definition of everything else. You know what I was thinking about in the way here is racism. Race. What do you think a racist is? What do you think racist is? I would think that a pure 100% certified racist is someone that hates someone because of their nationality with no no reason other than that, just because of who you are. Just because of the na nationality of y'all, you're hated. Like, if I hated someone Korean with no no reason just because they're Korean, I would think that would be a 100% certified racist. Yeah. How much of that you think is actually going on the way I'm saying it? I don't think a lot. I can't say none, but I can't think it's a lot. But look at the conditioning in this country. With one word crutches and throwing that around, just saying racist for anything and then run away. No explanation. Don't have to debate it. Just say it. Just use a one word crutch and make it stick. But you can't explain it. If someone's got terrible actions, I don't know, does something bad, breaks the law, does something, kills somebody, and I say something, call them out for what they're doing. And they have my nationality. Nobody said a word. But if they have another nationality, someone may hear it and go, you're, you're only saying that because you're a racist. Yeah, they go straight to it with no explanation. No, and I'll say, look, I'm explaining why I'm saying it. And they go, no, I know, you're a racist. And they run away. They won't say anything. They'll say F you and they run away. Yeah, that's allowed to go on too. Even on, in the big stage, it's allowed to go on. Now, you're not going to hear what I'm saying on CBS in 60 Minutes false. No. I've watched the conditioning of mankind in this country over decades. They made people... We don't need We don't need to change the First Amendment. I'm talking about the immoral people that are trying to manipulate people. We don't need to change the First Amendment. We'll just condition people to be scared to even speak over time. And we're basically changing the First Amendment by making them live in fear. That's what you got. With political idiocy correctness, I'll never abide to that ever. Never. I ain't never doing it while I'm breathing on the earth. False. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Nope. Watching this condition, stupidity. This country ain't even 300 years old founded. No, it's not old. No, it's not old. All the rah rah and about everything. No. I look at what's going on. People use, they've conditioned people to use one word crutches all over the place. And racism is one of them. Just throw it out there, make it stick, make someone live in fear, fire them, do something with no valid reason. Or then you got conspiracy theory. There's another one. Just straight go to to dismiss accountability for everything rotten going on behind the curtains. You no, know, it's all conspiracy. Everything's conspiracy. Everything is. None of that's provable. None of it is. It's all conspiracy theory. It's incredible to watch it. It's embarrassing to me. You know, and people are petrified to say anything. Look, excuse my language. This country's pussified is what it is. It's babyfied. A bunch of adults in diapers scared to say anything. Somebody said, and then they, someone says something, and they could logically explain it, but then they just run straight to and start apologizing and shit for what? You talk about some babies. Oh, yeah. Look, it's the way it is. I see it's pussyfied. 
you, that's not, you shouldn't say those curse words. Look, you got child trafficking going. You're worried about a curse word? If that bothers you in the country we live in, you got some problems. Yeah, it's not nice that I say it, but it's, it's, the, it's the way I can make my point directly. Look, it's pitiful. All over the place here. It. it just don't end. You just keep seeing it. That it's you know it makes me sick is to just hear racism and discrimination and entitlement those things that is just an abomination to me you know what people are entitled to here you know what they're entitled to everybody every nation now you're entitled to breed the rest is created by man you're entitled to breed and that's it get that through your head have a good one